there may be times when you're asked to complete a video to submit to a discussion or submit for an assignment. Let's take a look at how to do that. So I'm logged into Yuja. I did that. I came through Blackboard and I jumped on into my media. So what I want to do, first of all, is create just a nice little organized space to put my discussion assignments because we will submit for a discussion, but an assignment works the exact same way. So I'm going to create a new folder and I'm going to name it Discussions. Feel free to name your folder whatever suits your organizational purposes best. So we'll hit save. And now I have a new folder that works just like the folders in my windows. So I'm gonna open this up by double clicking on it and I'm gonna drop in my media. So I actually have a fun little video of a cat playing with his toy. Let's check it out just so you can see and make sure that we're moving around the right video. Um, but obviously this is just for example purposes. You'll wanna submit an actual assignment uh, actual assigned a video. Cute, right? I know. And the music just adds. So anyway, let's get this added to Yuja. All I have to do is grab it from my desktop or window or wherever you have it saved in your computer. I currently just have mine on my desktop and I'm going to drag it right on in here. So you have to wait for your video to upload and render within Yuja. This can actually take several minutes depending on the size of your video. So you'll just need to be patient. I'll fast forward through this part of this video and I'll meet you on the other side. You'll know your video is ready when you see one of the frames of the video within the thumbnail area in Yuja. So now we'll jump back into our course and add this to the discussion. So now we're back in the discussion area and I need to create a thread. That's just if you're working in a discussion. So now I'm going to title my thread. And we'll come on down to the content area. So right now I only have a limited number of options to work in this area and I need to come to the kebab menu to expand my options. So now we have access to the add content button. Let's click it and let's go grab our video. Scroll all the way down to Yuja Media Chooser, Bismarck State College. Once this window loads, you'll see any of the recent videos you have in your Yuja account. I only have two right now, but if you have a long list, you can come up here and search for your particular video. So make sure you're naming your video files properly so that you can find them later on if you need. I'm going to select our cat playing with his toy mouse and hit insert videos. So it only creates a link to your video, but we'll take a look at how that looks. Um, one thing you might want to keep in mind is you might have to add context to this video. You'll want to do better than this on your assignment, but this is for example purposes. So let's hit submit. Let's take a look at what that looks like. So here we have the link to my video and my little bit of context. And so we can take a look at this. As you can see, the video opens in a new window. It does not automatically play, which is kind of nice, but then we can go and check and make sure everything's working. The song never gets old. So now you know how to add a video to an assignment or a discussion.